How footballers spend their money. Football is the greatest sport on earth, and it'll blow your mind to hear how much a professional footballer earns. The world's best footballers earn unbelievable amounts of money, and they definitely put it to good use. Today, we'll be talking about some top footballers and how they spend their money. Make sure you like and subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon to stay updated with our videos. Here we go! Kylian Mbappe, the youngest scorer in a World Cup final and the hottest talent in French football right now, is the first on the list who earns an estimated $128 million annually. Given his substantial wealth, it raises curiosity about how he manages his finances. Kylian Mbappe, like other football stars, lives in a luxurious home. According to sources, the PSG player resides in a penthouse with stunning views of Paris, including the Champ de Mars and Eiffel Tower. The property is valued at $10.4 million. And despite not having a driver's license, Mbappe splurges on his collection of luxury cars. His most expensive vehicle is a Ferrari 488 Pista worth $565,000, and that's not even his only Ferrari. He reportedly also owns a Ferrari Hybrid SF90 Stradale along with other cars such as Volkswagen, Mercedes-Benz, Audi, BMW, and Range Rover. Mbappe isn't just fashionable when it comes to clothes, he also has become known for collecting high-end sneakers. After winning the 2018 World Cup, he donated all of his earnings from the tournament to charity and has also established his own foundation called Inspired by KM to support children in achieving their goals. Next up is Mbappe's fellow PSG star Neymar, who is still on top of his game for Brazil and PSG. In 2021, he earned $70 million from football and another $25 million from endorsements and deals and is among the top four highest paid athletes. His luxury car fleet is estimated to be worth over $1.2 million US, includes vehicles such as a Maserati MC12, Ferrari 458 Italia, Porsche Panamera Turbo, Audi Q7, and Volkswagen's classic Touareg. In addition to this, he owns a Cessna 680 jet worth approximately $7.4 million US. Neymar owns expensive properties, including a $9 million villa in his hometown and a mansion worth $3.3 million in Sao Paulo, Brazil, which has a squash court, swimming pool, panoramic lift, and a garage that can accommodate 20 cars. According to Business Insider, in 2014, before the World Cup, Neymar spent a staggering $180,000 on 16 watches and accessories at a Gaga Milano boutique in Tokyo as an expression of his love for the brand. Neymar is definitely living the life. Next up is Zlatan Ibrahimovic. A generational talent, the 41-year-old star spent most of his career in Europe in clubs like Barcelona, Inter Milan, AC Milan, Manchester United with a brief two-year stint in Los Angeles and made a small fortune in the process. Zlatan is not only known for his skills on the field but also for his extravagant lifestyle. He owns multiple luxury yachts including an $8 million Riva Corsaro and a recently acquired Benelli yacht. Additionally, he's invested in sports complexes and paddle centers in Sweden under the name Paddlezinter. As a way to escape from public attention, Ibrahimovic purchased an island located 25 miles off the port of Stockholm for approximately $5 million. Ibrahimovic's car collection primarily consists of Audis, Volvos, Ferraris, and some Porsches. Unlike many other collectors, he actually drives the cars he purchases. In 2020, Ibrahimovic was spotted driving his rare black Ferrari Monza SP2 in Stockholm. Additionally, he's known for being a significant collector of Harley Davidsons as well. Moving on to Erling Holland, the talented young player from Norway has quickly become a sensation in the football community. He just broke the record for the most goals in a single season in the Premier League as well as won the treble in his debut campaign with Man City. In his brief period of fame, Holland has attracted attention for his extravagant expenditures. He possesses an affinity for opulent timepieces and can often be seen donning prestigious watches crafted by renowned brands such as Patek Philippe and Rolex. He spent 6.5 million euros on a 981 square feet mansion in Marbella, Spain. He also has another mansion located just 10 kilometers from this one. Erling has spent 50,000 pounds on a cryotherapy chamber to stay in mint condition as he's obsessed with getting better and better. This is majorly to prevent injuries as he suffered in his Dortmund days. 
Moreover, he harbors a deep interest in high-speed automobiles and is frequently spotted cruising around in his Lamborghini Aventador to indulge this passion. His collection includes an Audi RS7, Audi Q7, Mercedes-Benz GT63, and BMW M5. Other than this, he loves buying sneaks. Lastly, Holland has also made many investments for his future to be secure. Now, on to the man that needs no introduction, the most decorated player in football history, the player with the most Ballon d'Ors, and who just won the World Cup to put an end to the GOAT debate. We're talking about Lionel Messi, the highest paid athlete globally, earning $130 million between May 2021 and May 2022. Forbes reports that he's accumulated a career earnings of $1.15 billion. Lionel Messi is known for owning a collection of luxury cars, including a $2 million Pagani Zonda Tricolore, Ferrari F430 Spider, Dodge Charger SRT8, and Maserati Gran Turismo. Lionel Messi owns multiple luxurious properties, including a $7 million mansion near Barcelona, an eco house related to his career, a mansion in Rosario, and an exclusive condominium floor in Florida. He also owns the hotel chain MIM Hotel since 2017, with resorts located in Ibiza, Mallorca, Barcelona, and has recently opened its first winter resort in the Aran Valley. The hotel has 141 rooms and offers amenities such as a spa, indoor swimming pool, fitness center, and mountain guide services. Messi owns a $15 million private jet and likes to vacation in various locations such as Ibiza, Argentina, and Miami. He celebrated his 35th birthday in Ibiza with his family and former Barcelona teammates. After winning the 2021 Copa America with Argentina, he rented a luxurious mansion in Key Biscayne for his stay in Miami, which charges $10,000 per night. Messi also established the Lionel Messi Foundation in 2007 to assist vulnerable children globally. In 2017 and 2019, he personally contributed funds to support various causes such as building classrooms for war orphan children in Syria and providing food and water to citizens in Kenya through the foundation's donations. That marks the end of our video. We hope you liked it. Make sure you like the video and subscribe to our channel before going. We'll be back with more football content soon. So hit the notification bell to be notified and we'll see you next time.